Yo, what you got for weekly wagers for this week? I know you got some shit. Mm, let me tell you. I like the Seahawks over the Titans this week. I think the Seahawks really? got a little something. Yeah, I think the Seahawks got a little something. Geno Smith playing good. You got Lockett healthy. You got DK Metcalf healthy. Geno Smith is a pretty good quarterback in the right situation. He is a situational quarterback. So I believe that he can do it again. He's been rolling. He got more yards than Russell Wilson right now. The Russell dude's Wilson. top five right now in passing yards and completion percent. Who would have seen that shit coming? No one. But you got these two monster receivers, bro. And you got uh, Rashad Penny running that thing, too. So, man, they doing big things, man. They're they, they finna get right back in the, in, in the swing of things, bro, in that NFC. You know what one I'm liking? I am liking your Buccaneers to finally win for the third game, third straight game at home. They cannot lose to the Falcons, bro. There's no way, no Falcons. question. Mm -mm. After just losing that's Cordell no Patterson. Game either. Yes, With Patterson man. down, right? Yeah, that, yeah that's, that should be a wash. That should be a definite wash. And I and I believe that the Bucs still have a lot of their key players back, if not most of their key players back. Nobody's dinged up. Right. What they better do is chill the fuck out with trying to rush Godwin back, bro. That's, that's what it. They I don't need know why do. they keep putting them back in there, man. For real, you got to sit them down. You gotta Bro, you down. ain't playing for at least another four put games. In, I don't care how good you're feeling. Put in Scotty Miller, man. Put in my boy Scotty Miller right now, for real. He going to handle all that offensive problems, everything that we got offensively, bro. That one person, bro, because he's so smart and he knows that offense, for real. He needs to teach He needs to teach the younger guys, man. Teach those guys, for real. Because Scotty Miller, man, whew, I'm telling you, he get back on the field, bro, that offense is going to be scary. Uh, the Bucks is favored by eight in that game, by the way. And the game before, you said you had the uh, Seahawks upsetting the Saints. Saints are currently favored by six right now. Game scheduled to be Seahawks, played in New Orleans. Seahawks and Titans. Oh, no, no, you got no, no, the no, Titans, no, no. too? No, Seahawks over the Saints. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, Seahawks over the Saints. Yep. I mm -hmm. know. That's what I said. Right, right, right. And I know it. I got a little tongue tied a little bit. Don't worry about it. I got you. Okay, cool. I thought you was trying. I I thought you was trying to uh, call me out here and put me on the uh, spot. Uh, no, no. I just in front of at our my, in front of I our just audience. looked at my notes wrong. Had did the little cross eye. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> my bad, man. My bad. Yeah, How about good. Cincinnati at Baltimore this week? Baltimore's favored by three. Cincinnati's won their last two games versus Miami and the Jets. Burrow has been looking better. Baltimore's defense is atrocious. They're allowing 437 yards a game. Uh, I don't know. I could see Cincy pulling that one off, man. I could see that as a potential upset this week. There's a lot. There's a lot of close games again this week mm -hmm. uh, for the NFL. So I only wrote a couple of them down, but that was my potential upset. I had is Cincy, Cincy potentially upsetting Baltimore. I could see them doing it. I think the Ravens is gonna have to put up more points, man. Because at the end of the games, man, they really just they lose their mojo. So I still feel like the Ravens are gonna beat the beat the Cincinnati Bengals. Probably a couple points. It's not it's gonna be a close game because all the games are close right now. Because like I say, the defense. So hopefully somebody on defense can make one crucial play and get those boys back on the slide of uh, the Bengals. Cause I mean they won a couple games, but it's been it's it's been weak games, man, for real. So they're they're back even, but I don't think they got that juice back either yet. Not yet. Looking at this one, can you please explain to me how the fuck Kansas City is only favored by seven right now over the Va Las Vegas Raiders? Because the Raiders just won the last two, so they're getting hotter. They're starting to uh, jail. Raiders yeah. have won their. Raiders have won one game. They just got their first win versus Denver. They've won one I game. They this won year. two games. They didn't win two games. No, they've won one. The first one okay. versus Denver. And Josh okay. Jacobs went ham, bro. Ran for 144 yards, two touchdowns, and they was talking about trading him. And they need bro. him. They need, but he haven't had a touchdown since that game, bro. Like I say, he hasn't been. He has been fulfilling that. Well, he had that two void. that last game. So I, right. So hopefully, but before that, yeah. Well, they the train, they were all man. looking That's, bad though, man. Yeah, that's a good kid, man. For real. I like Josh Jacobs a lot, bro. His story is awesome. Devontae Adams got his 
100 yards again. He had a quiet game the game before that, so that was good. Man, he throws to him so much. Like, I understand it's Devontae Adams, but damn, mm-hmm. dude, like, spread right. that shit around, bro. I think Hemf- Derek Carr. Hemfro, Hemfro is hurt, I believe, too. Renfro, yeah, he's had a concussion. Right. I don't know when he's going to come back, but that Mac Hollins has been stepping up, too, the other receiver. So, you know, anytime that Devontae Adams is lined up on the other side of the field, you're probably going to get some decent looks and opportunity, to be right. honest. So, so I, I also, know. so I also got the Rams over the Cowboys this week with Cooper Rush running out of uh, juice. Really? I got the Rams, Rams over, the over the Cowboys. Rams looked pretty bad uh, last uh, the other night. Last they week, they did. Last they're game. favored by five right now, though. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think over they're. The I think they're at LA, but they looked like ju- uh, truck juice, garbage truck juice on offense. Dude. I think I might take the Cowboys to win that game. You think Rush still got it? I think Rush is just, he's managing the game so well, and I think that he's really developing a connection with his receivers. He's throwing to the people he's supposed to be throwing. Like, I'm looking, C.D. Lamb's, like, has a bunch of targets. Um, he's He'll get a Gallup. I think that was Gallup's first game back last game. He'll get him right. more factored in eventually. Yeah, that's what he um, did. That's one of my, he's doing one what of he's my, supposed to be doing. He's throwing right. to the people that you're supposed to be throwing to. Yeah, I, I like how they're getting their looks. Uh, I don't know, man. I just that's one of my guys on the waiver wire this year too. That's one of my guys on the waiver wire, Michael Gallup. Okay, I bet you that would be a low scoring game, Dallas and uh, right LA. I bet you that'd be a low scoring game. Definitely. And, and dude, what's going on with LA's defense? The Rams' defense, bro. Oh my god. Dude, you see uh, Debo when he broke that run, that touchdown oh, catch yeah. the other dude mm-hmm. that was went awesome. around Ramsey like Ramsey bro, was nothing. Bro, What's Ramsey. going on with Ramsey, bro? Really, for real. He hold on, I'm a, big stuff. Hold on, I gotta. I, I I'm refilling my drink real quick, and I'm gonna just tell Jalen Ramsey I'm gonna pour one out for you, bro, because you. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, bro, he is getting torched. Okay. Hey man, that's messed up because I love LA. Check hey man, I got bro, bro, I got nothing but love for LA too. Don't get me wrong. Oh I shit. Love LA. <laughs> bro, I loved LA too. Don't get me wrong. Yeah, you yes, got the sir. double shot glasses. Believe you got the doubles. But all oh, I'm saying man. is Ramsey ain't looking to uh Ramsey no more, man. Holy shit. Mm-mm, for real. He hit a miss right now, man. For real. I think all his good years are behind him. He's just playing for that money now. Yeah. 